I just got off work. My evening is about to start and I thought I would just take you with me on a perfect evening in with me, Mary. Today you're gonna follow me through the basic things that I do on a weekday evening after work and I'll be doing everything in collaboration with things I got from Public Goods. I'm gonna do a really fun product review throughout the video so you can come along with me. I'm hoping this is more of a fun layout versus just sitting in front of my camera talking about each item and why I like it. I think it's better if I just take you through my day and show you instead. So let's jump into it. So I thought while I take you guys through my evening, I would drop little hints about public goods and what I really like about it. The first thing you should know, it's a subscription-based online website where you can get amazing goods, household goods from a single source. Everything is sourced straight from one company and that's amazing. It reduces the transportation time. It's really great. It's $59 a year which comes out to like about $5 a month which is basically nothing and having that subscription allows you to purchase things from their website. First thing I'm going to use before I go on my evening walk is their chapstick and what i love about this lip balm is the ingredients are basically nothing it's coconut oil shea butter and wax that's it so you're knowing that it's good for you good for the environment and it's going to do the job perfectly let's go on my walk hey guys so i'm on my walk i love to take walks after work I usually work out too, but on days that are just a little bit more stressful, I just take nice long walks as long as the sun is out. And I always listen to a podcast. So right now I'm listening to my favorite, which is Armchair Expert with Dax Shepard and Monica Padmet. And I'm listening to the Prince Harry episode, which has been pretty interesting because, you know, you don't expect Prince Harry to be very like personable. But I really enjoy this conversation. I love how much he focuses on mental health. And it's just, I love the length of armchair episodes because they're always over an hour and it helps me be motivated to take longer than hour walks. The weather is pretty cold today, so I'm layering with some Patagonia puffer jacket. This is probably the favorite part of my evening routine. And especially during the spring, summertime, the sun sets later and I love it so much. So yeah, I'm gonna go finish up my walk and I'll see you guys later for dinner. just made dinner. I made a really simple penny alfredo with shrimp, scallops, and whatever vegetables I had in the fridge. And then I just made a little garlic toast with my public goods garlic powder. Really quick, easy garlic bread. And while I eat my dinner, I thought I would talk to you guys a little bit about public goods. What I like about this brand is any leftover food products that they have whether it's like their garlic powder or they sell pasta ramen noodles a bunch of stuff balsamic vinegar whatever it is whatever is in excess they donate it to the saint mary's food bank like i said as i go through this video i want to do like little snippets of reviews of public goods and why i like it so much as i mentioned it only cost five dollars less than five dollars actually a month to be a part of this website to be a part of this community 
the moment you start your membership, you have instant access to sustainable products at such a lower cost. Everything is super high quality. I really love this garlic powder. It's organic, it's non-GMO, and it's super easy to use whether it's in your pasta, in your garlic bread. Yeah, I just love all the options that they have. Everything is so great. Like this is my produce bag and I love it so much. It's super sturdy. This mesh is like unbreakable and I keep all my produce in here so that when I go to the grocery store or farmer's market, I don't need to grab an extra one of those plastic produce bags that just end up going into the waste. Obviously, there's one thing I noticed and I should be pretty open about it. This brand is not like 100% zero waste. I feel like that's very impossible to do, especially when it's an online resource. But they really try their best to reduce the waste, even in their packaging. I'll make sure to link down everything that I use in the description box below. But now I'm going to enjoy my dinner. And, you know, people say you shouldn't watch TV while you eat because then you end up eating more than you're supposed to. But I've been hooked on Modern Family recently. It's my first time watching it, which is a surprise because I've basically watched every sitcom known to man. But, yeah, I just never got around to watching Modern Family. And then I started and I'm really loving it. I really love all the characters so much, but my favorite has got to be Phil, which is not a bias that my boyfriend's name is Phil. It's just that I think he's such a good dad and he's so goofy. So yeah, I'm gonna watch that while I eat and you can follow me for the rest of this night. <laughs> Hi guys, I just took off my towel because my hair is decently dry now and it's almost the end of the night. I just finished reading a chapter of Outliers by Malcolm Gladwell. It's the book I'm reading right now and I got the Tuyu, the soy milk to drink for dessert. Constantly eating and drinking things, guys. Shake, shake, shake. Thought while I drink this, 
I would take some time to do a little review of the products I've used so far from Public Goods. I think out of everything that I've used so far, I really like the chapstick. I feel like it's super hydrating and you can really just feel the work of the Shia butter. And I also really appreciated the candle. It had such a nice smell, kind of like a blend of fruitiness and a clean scent. Really perfect to make my room have this warm ambiance for when I'm about to read. The thing that I disliked the most was the tea bags and not because the tea wasn't good because the tea was good and i'm so thankful it's like an uncaffeinated tea i can drink at night I had like i got the chamomile spearmint so i loved the mintiness of it but i just hate how much plastic it used in the packaging because each tea bag was just wrapped in this plastic I wasn't a huge fan of that. Overall, I think everything that I've used from Public Goods is great and I would recommend it to everyone. So before I finish off this video, I just wanted to let you guys know I have a code in the description box. It's Mary Kim PGA. Mary Kim PGA. You'll get 15% off your first Public Goods order if you use this discount. So if you liked anything you saw in this video or you want to see what else they have, which by the way, they ha literally have everything. You don't need to go to multiple stores anymore. Public Goods has everything you're looking for. You can look at the link below and browse through their store. There's a few more things I'm going to do to unwind for the rest of the day, but I think this is where I'm going to end my little talking spiel with you guys. If there's anything from Public Goods that you liked, make sure you click the links down below and use the discount code to save and yeah thanks for joining me this evening and again thank you public goods for sending all these awesome products and also giving me a glimpse to the annual subscription i'm so excited to see what else i can get from that i'm gonna enjoy this cookie that i got from a coffee shop earlier um maybe watch something <laughs> don't talk while you eat mary <laughs> thanks for watching continue watching this video but if i don't talk to you after this click like and subscribe don't forget it have a good night everyone <laughs>